Uh, hi guys. Recently on my TikTok, I've been getting a lot of videos of uh, these pictures that were taken right before someone dies. And I'm not gonna lie, they're pretty creepy. And usually in the background of, the so of those videos, they have this stupid song. I, I don't know what the point of the song is. I think maybe they think it's scary where it goes, Daisy, Daisy, give me a light or two. I'm half crazy. Like, bro. It's not creepy, bro. That is the most least creepiest thing I've ever heard in my entire life, bro. It, it's not creepy. It's not edgy. It's just stupid. Straight up stupid, okay? I just had to express my... Bro, why my hat look like a badonka donk, bro? What the fuck? This shit really look like a badonka donk. Anyways, without further ado, today... Wait, I didn't even tell you what we were looking at. Today, we're checking out 15 photos taken right before death. Bro, have you ever taken a photo and you almost died? That actually happened to me. I swore on my life. I, I swear to God, that's actually happened to me. I took in a photo and literally seconds, I think probably milliseconds after, I almost got hit by a train. Sw I swear to God, guys, you, you're going to think I'm lying. I'll save that for a story time. Anyways, without further ado, let's get the Come on, shit! In this photo, a boy seen drowning in the back. Hey, bro, why are you smiling, bro? Why are you smiling? Bro, this was set up, bro. Bro, this man about to turn into Jason from Friday the 13th. Like, all, look at all of them just happy, smiling. Bro, can't you look inside the camera viewfinder and see that a boy is drowning? Sheesh. These people need to get arrested. Hey, sap. A young boy drowned while class trip on a trip, too. The boys in the front didn't notice him drowning. But, but how don't you notice someone drown? How don't you know someone drowning behind you, bro? That thing happened. Shortly after, this group was shot was taken. Wait, wait, what? Shortly after this group shot was taken. Oh, I thought they said the after. I thought they were saying this group got shot. Oh, shortly after this group shot was taken, the boy in the red shirt was killed on a hike by a falling rock. Yo, R.I.P. Man, R.I.P. Damn! Damn! Bro, just imagine your life, bro. Oh, never take anything for granted, man. Seriously, bro. Live your life to the fullest. Annie Faber sent this selfie to her boyfriend only a few minutes before being abducted and murdered. Damn, bro! That's tough. You know, my second biggest fear, or probably my third biggest fear, my number one biggest fear. It's paper cuts, bro. I just hate paper cuts. Anything that deals with paper cuts, it just... I can't look at it. But my third fear is probably uh, being abducted while I'm in an Uber. That is actually my third biggest fear. Because how the hell am I going to escape? I know I could beat the freak out of the guy, but sheesh! And he was out on a bike ride by herself when she got caught in the rain. She sent a selfie to her boyfriend to show him her body was found two weeks later in the woods! Damn! Damn! Damn, damn, damn! Now, for real though, RIP. Two engineers stand on a burning windmill? Are they kissing, bro? What the hell are they doing? In the Netherlands, two engineers were performing maintenance on a wind turbine when they caught on fire. Bro, low key though. I would have jumped on one of those blades, swung all the way down like a pole, and uh, probably jump off. I think I could survive that, bro. Probably break a few bones, but at least you would survive. It's better than burning alive. Bro, that low-key rhyme, sheesh. The only escape route became blocked. One worker jumped off the turbine. The other one burned to death. You see how it says one worker jumped off the turbine. They never said he died. The other one burned to death. See, I'd rather break a few bones or break most of my bones and still be alive than to burn to death, bro. Sheesh. But RIP to man. RIP. Christine, Christina Grimmy giving her last performance before she was murdered. Sheesh. Yeah, I remember this, man. Damn, I remember this like it was yesterday. 2016. I was hanging out with some friends and I saw it trending on Twitter. I had no clue, clue, clue she was. She, I had no clue who she was, but rest in peace, bro. Rest in peace. Damn, that was in 2016? I could have swore that was like two years ago. A fan took a taxi from St. Petersburg to Orlando armed with two handguns and a hunting knife, bro. Shit, bro, why is my phone blowing up? Grimmy's brother tackled a man, but he soon shot and killed himself? He did not know Grimmy. Damn! 
Wait, who killed himself? The brother or the shooter, man? I'm confused, bro. This person don't know how to type English. Baseball star Roy ha Halliday posted his photo to Twitter just a few hours before his death. Damn! Damn! He just won the chip. Imagine just winning the championship. And then you die, bro. Yo, live your life to the fullest, man. At least he, he ended up his life winning a championship. That's a, that's a good way to go out. I'm not saying he should have died, but I'm just saying, like, at least he died knowing his team won. You feel me? He was the only person in the plane when it crashed, killing him. Oh, yeah, that's my other fear. Airplanes, bro. Bro, I can't get on those sheets. Seriously. I've been on a few, but nah, I can't go on that, man. Scared of them. The Phillies and the Blue Jays baseball team for which she retired. Oh, man, that's nice. Shani Nunes took this photo before jumping off a cliff. Damn, bro. Damn. Nunesy was trying to was not trying to commit suicide. She was in Hawaii at a spot popular for cliff diving after she got caught in the current and drowned. Bro. 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 Loki, how they got this photo, though? Loki. This probably was taken a long time ago, and I'm pretty sure phones was not waterproof. So how the hell they got this picture? Hey, what the? What the? Investigate a whoopsie. I'm not saying she didn't die, but like, bro, what the? All right, anyways, to, to, to go at Razio 21 the night before she was killed in the U.S. airstrike that demolished her home in Mosul, Iraq. Damn! Oh! What? The night before she died, her family hosted a party at her house. She let a sparkler in her in her father's skull and told her to go outside. It was dangerous to have a sparkler in the house. Damn. Damn. Only 21. Jeez. I'm about to turn 21 in like a year or two. Bro, that's super young. Damn. Damn. That night, their house was hit by U.S. airstrike to... And her mother, aunt, and uncle and cousin were killed. Only her father survived. Damn, bro. That's tough. That's tough, bro. Sheesh. Singer and actress Gianni Rivera and her staff boarded a plane at Monterey International Airport. Hey, bro. It looks like they're having a good time. I'm not... The small jet crashed, killing everyone on board. Damn, bro. What's up with all these people having a good time before they end up getting killed? Sheesh! Sydney Luke posted this image to social media before being strangled on a Tinder. Damn, bro! Sheesh! Never trust everybody you meet online. Sheesh. The man who killed her falsely claimed the death was an accident? What? Though there's no evidence that suggests that this was anything other than a murder. Hey, bro. What you trying to say? Hey, she was ready for her date, though. Bro, no, that's messed up, bro. Why that? I was reading the caption. She died, bro. Well, out of all pictures, why they showed that? I mean, no, the video's called Photos Taken Before Disasters. Let me stop talking, bro. A Turkish grandmother proudly shows off a meal she cooked before having a heart attack. Damn, bro. This is seriously making me question my life, man. Should I even take pictures anymore? I'm scared to take pictures. While having a good time, cause I might die. Don't that low key run, bro? What, bro? What, bro? What, bro? What, bro? What, bro? What? A stowaway falls from the wheel well of a plane, bro. When I was little, I always wanted to jump off a plane, bro. I thought maybe I like land in the ocean, bro, but I'll probably end up dying. A 14 named Cook tried to stowaway in a flight bound for Japan. He fell from a plane shortly after takeoff. Damn. Bro, what? Bro, what? Bro, this is not just scary. This is sad. Damn, bro. 14. Damn. That's hella young. Stung away in a wheel well is incredibly dangerous. Not only. Yeah, I think it's. I think it's pretty safe. We know jumping off an airplane. Is dangerous. I don't think you have to tell us that. I think we know jumping off an airplane is dangerous, bro. You feel me? Damn, bro. That that's sad. That's sad. But Loki, this music, Loki, relaxing though. It's making me kind of sleepy. I'm not gonna lie. What type of music is this, bro? 
Okay. This photo was found on the cell phone of a hiker whose body was recovered from a cliff wedge? Okay. What happened, bro? What happened? The hiker had disappeared while hiking Yosemite. Hey, bro, ain't that that Travis Scott song, bro? I could have sworn that's that Travis Scott song. His body was found out about a month later. It was believed he fell off a cliff! Damn! Damn, bro. This is giving me new fears, bro. Now I'm scared of... Ch Cherry's pre Periwinkle was shopping with her family in Dollar General when a man approached them and offered to buy them clothes. Hey, that's nice. Hey, that's nice. That's a nice thing. You feel me? How can something like this go wrong? You feel me? The family went with him to Walmart where he then offered to take Cherry's to a McDonald's to get a hamburger, but instead got abducted and murdered her! Bro! Bro! Now, there's some fucked up people in this world. Her body was recorded. Bro, who are these fucked up people, bro? Who are these fucked up people? JFK's older brother poses for a photo before dying in combat later that day. I mean, yeah, man, was in war. I mean, it's sad to see people die in war, but, like, what did you expect? You feel me? Yeah, I mean, what do you expect? He's fighting in a world war. Bro, sheesh. Alright, I guess that's the end of the video. So, you might be wondering, bro, Wubsy, why did you react to this video? What did you learn from it? I learned never to take photos when I'm happy. Because most likely, something bad is going to happen to me, bro. Sheesh! I unlock some new fears now. Paper cuts is still my number one fear, bro. I hate paper cuts. Ugh, I'm just thinking about it! It hurts! Bro, who made paper cuts? Who invented paper cuts, bro? Fun fact... One of my brothers actually got a paper cut in his eyeball. Oh, in his eyeball. I'm not. Oh, shush, shush, shush. Luckily, he did not go blind from it, but it did happen. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed today's video, let me know by leaving a like. Comment down below which one of these was the most scary one. Probably the person who got abducted, bro. That shit's scary. Imagine thinking you're about to get a hamburger, but instead, the person is a crazy psychopath who's going to kill you. Bro, that is scary, bro. Anyways, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Last but not least, I love every single one of you guys. And I'll catch you guys next time.